Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Red Dead Redemption 2. It's your boy Color Gaming, and you know how we do things around here. I have changed my mind in between episodes. I am not going to talk to Dutch because I need a break from him and his I, I need a little bit of time. I I need y'all to have a little bit of goddamn faith. I uh, I uh, I need a little bit of money. One last good lick and then we're out of here. Tahiti baby. I need a break from him. You understand me? I need a break from him. So what we're going to do instead, we're going to talk to Sadie Adler, man. That's what we're going to do. Um, and Saint Denis already was closer than I expected to be. <laughs> and I have my semi-automatic shotgun. I have my Lancaster. I have, I have everything that I had before. I even have my old outfit now. We look good. We look great. Everything is back in order. A lot. Excuse me, Are you good, my guy? Dragging me through the streets, put me on your back, motherfucker. What's wrong with these people? <laughs> Mister, are you okay? Mister, are you okay? I was alright. Are you okay, Mister? Scratch my back, man. Bruises and fucking dragging me across town. You don't look so good. Let's get you to a doctor. Oh, you're a good guy. Thank you. Are you just gonna make me walk behind you? Oh. On, it's not far. Just down the street here. Uh. <laughs> Wait a minute, give me a minute. Give me a minute. <laughs> oh, I'm coughing up blood. You head in there, friend. Go on. All right. Hello. Can I help you? Uh, I, I need a doctor. Oh, uh, just one second, sir. Come in, pal. Come in. I need some help. And so it seems. <coughs> and that's Dr. Mister to you. Dr. Mister? Sid. I'm sorry. Uh, I was joking. Look, friend, I don't mean nothing, but you got money? I mean, before I start treating you, because I got a family. Yeah, I understand. Here, let do you. Uh, sure. Thank you. Now, what's wrong? I mean, what appear to be the symptoms? Well, I think you've heard them, and coughing uh, is there any blood sometimes uh -huh. okay now here breathe again yeah. let me see your tongue now say ah ah what is it not good news. Well, I guess that. You got tuberculosis. I'm really sorry for you, son. It's a hell of a thing. Oh, what do you mean? You're real sick. You. It's a progressive disease. You'll be. 
Now, the best thing is rest and getting somewhere warm and dry and taking it easy. Now, is that possible? Sure, I can just take my winters in my country club in California. No, it's not possible. Well, like I said, I, I'm real sorry. Yeah, well. Now, yeah, wait, wait. Uh, let me get you a little bit more energy today. Hope that nail was clean, motherfucker. You smoking in the doctor's office, you dumb motherfucker? So, uh... Oh, my money's back! It is, but I'm dying, so what, what does it matter? Leave the area. This is how we go out, huh? No matter what we do here, this is how our story ends. Or how it's gonna end. We can't change what's done. We can only move on. You have it in you, I can tell. I don't think you're supposed to be in town. Interesting. Well, there's not much I can do here now other than say the Adler's quest. Problems coming in? Nah. Guess they know now we ain't in the city. Who, Mr. Milton's friends? Yeah, they've had patrols out ever since you boys disappeared. Well, at least you're alive. For now. For now, yeah. <laughs> what happened in um... Guama? Yeah. <coughs> Nothing nice. What happened to Dutch? Because he seems. I don't know. Seems as. What began happening in Blackwater began happening years ago, maybe. A slow decline, I guess. What do you mean? I ain't quite sure. What happened here? I started gathering people up as best I could after you boys left. And John, you know that part. I do. And Hosea? So I too. Hell, we got Lenny's body out as well. Robbed the morgue and buried them together. Follow me. So, what's your plan here? Well, I figure before we do anything, we need to make sure John's even still at this prison. And how do we do that? We need to get up high enough to get a proper look at the place. What? It's on an island, ain't it? Unless you're planning on learning how to fly. That's exactly what we're gonna do. I found us a hot air balloon. <laughs> They're gonna shoot us down. Now, the pilot, or whatever you call him, he thinks we're just in it for a lesson. Bit of a tour. 
<laughs> He's quite the character. I think you'll like him. You know, I'm impressed. You really stepped things up, ain't you? Hey, we didn't know if you was even coming back. Whole thing hit folks real hard. You can see it. Heron's gone falling fully into the bottle. Strauss is a bag of nerves. Swanson, well, Swanson's actually gone and cleaned up his act. So I guess it ain't all gone to shit. I'm just happy you boys were able to find us. Javier said he got the letter I left at the post office. That was a good idea. Until the Pinkerton showed up. Oh, by the way, I've been hunting O'Driscoll boys. She a beauty, ain't she? From here on the ground, yes. They are gonna Mr. shoot Bullard? us down. <laughs> Mr. Bullard! Ah, Mrs. Adler! It's good to see you! Good to see you! Ah, uh, this is my friend I told you about, Mr. Morgan. Ah, yes, Arturo Bullard. At your service, sir. At your service. Arthur Morgan. Well, it's a nice, fresh day for flying, sir. A day like today, an Icarus would have made it across the sea. Ha ha ha. Have you ever flown before, sir? No. Oh, it's quite a thing. Quite a thing. Now, put these on and hop in. Well, ain't she coming? Ah, well, women can't fly, sir. Are you insane? They can't. Oh, no, sir. It does terrible damage to them, to their vapors. I thought everyone knew about that. Why, a delicate flower like Mrs. Adler? <laughs> Heavens above or below. Ah. Where'd you find this guy? I told you you two would get on. <sighs> Are you sure about this? Certain, sir. Quite certain. Mrs., let us away. <clears throat> Wish us luck. I've only crashed twice. Now, uh, pull on that rope uh, and hope for the best. Ah! You boys have fun. How did you get out of this? <laughs> up, up, and away. Right. Time to catch a few vapors of our own. It's a little overcast, but I'm expecting some good wind once we're high enough. We should still have some decent views over the river. Now, one hates to be coarse, but on the subject of ablutions, liquids over the side, solids, do your utmost to levy the situation until we land. Okay, Mr. Bullard. I had a client once who fell foul to a rotten oyster on the ascent. Decidedly harrowing experience for all involved. Keep going, sir. We need to get up above the clouds. It really is stunning up there. You'll have seen nothing like it. All right, then. Let's break through these clouds. Heavenly indeed. Quite remarkable, isn't it? Feels like we have a nice westerly wind, so keep her around this height. This particular vessel is state of the art, sir. Imported from Europe. Won't find more than a couple of these on this side of the pond. So long as it works. You shouldn't be doing this. No, not at all. A child could operate this with a little supervision. Besides, Mrs. Adler told me you were very keen to learn the ropes. We have plenty of those. She did, did she? A gorgeous Arthur view. And Arturo. How perfect is this? My mother was a keen student of the Italian eight. My brother's called Baldassario, so you could say I got off lightly. Look, I I'm trying to concentrate here. I'm rich, bitch! <laughs> I'm alright, thank 
Captain. <laughs> Recalling the ablutions discussion. Well, just say the word. Definitely not. I prefer slightly more feminine attire on a lady, but variety is the very... <laughs> or is it, though? Did you know they locked up the man who wrote that in a mental asylum? I did not, Mr. Bullard. See that building up ahead on the island? That's the infamous Sisica Penitentiary. Is it now? Tell me more. Fly too near to it, though, sir. Sorry, we're going in for a closer look. What do you mean? What do you Mr. mean? Morgan, please, this is most irregular. Well, you want to have your customer, don't you? Look, this isn't funny now. What on earth are you doing? The guards are bound to spot us. Calm down. They won't care if we stay high enough. I'm just looking for a friend of mine. A friend? Poor bastard has a habit of being in the wrong place at the wrong time. I heard they got him working the fields in a chain gang. Dear God. It's more productive than your ablution talk, man. Hmm. The wind. Well, this is most unusual. Relax, Mr. Bullard. And take over. And keep us well away. I'll do my best. This filly isn't the easiest to control, you know. Be quiet. Please hurry. That ain't John. All right. No, you didn't with your goddamn ablutions. You're a fool! Wind speed is picking up. We should stay at this altitude. It's heading northwesterly, so that should take us back to land. Damn, I got shot! <laughs> Whoever got me, fair play to you. Uh, we're in the clear now, Mr. Bullard. Get up. Good lord! My heart is pounding! <sighs> I must say, the specifics of this job were not described to me at all sufficiently. Well, it's done now. <gasps> ah, there's Annisberg. Sure. Good hmm. lord, is that... is that Mrs. Adler? Where? Being chased. Trying to get us near. Will there be more trouble, sir? I expect so. I'm starting to rather enjoy this. Oops, sorry, horsey. Did you say you what the hell? Hey, say it! Up there! Shit! They're over. This is Adler has a lot to answer for. That's your spine gone, bruh. Yes, she does. This is, oh dear, that boiled egg feels decided. What? Whoa, with the old trick. Ah, what kind of use to this fight? Come on. Oh my god! 
Any more for any more. Having fun, aren't you? That could be an album cover right there. my way I can't even shoot them Nearly come on I'm on my way this is not where you die come on Landing, all things considered. There's more of them on the other side. They must have followed us. Get behind something. This ain't over yet. Well, I, I think the Lancaster is pretty cool. You can't leave it for one day. Let's kill these sons of bitches. Nicely done. Ah, uh, fuck your head. That's insane. I don't have a clear shot of anyone though. Fuck. This is stupid. This is stupid. Uh. Phenomenal. That's a hat trick where I'm from. Aggressive, how are you gonna push? All right, no, not the boat. What did you do? Where's my semi automatic bastard? Get the fuck. I hate we made it. That'll show them. 
you sound real demonic right now. I only left you an hour ago. You can't stay out of trouble for one goddamn hour. You got that poor bastard killed for his troubles. I kind of liked him. They got Comb, the government. They got Comb O'Driscoll. They're gonna hang him in San Denis. Hang him? Okay. Mm -mm. He's already been tried twice for murder and found guilty. Sure, no doubt he'll escape again. No, he won't, because we're gonna make sure of it. I... We have our own problems with the law, in case you ain't noticed. Dutch will want to see him swing. <coughs> sure, Dutch. He wouldn't even help us with Marston. And our situation is really messed up right now. You know how things is. Bastard's gonna swing. I'm gonna make sure of it. Closely followed by Marston. You saw him? Yes, in the fields. Okay. Then we go rescue him. <coughs> From a state penitentiary? No. But from the fields? Yes. That we can manage. It's well guarded. Guarded, sure, but not behind bars. No, it's not behind bars. So, that's how we'll do it. Bust him from his work detail. I guess. It's best just the two of us go. <coughs> the two of us is all there is, anyhow. Good, because two is all we'll need. I'll get us a bump. Well, Glad that's freaking settled then. Sneak in and get him out of there. Meet me at Copperhead Landing. Thank you, Arthur. Whatever You're gonna get yourself you killed, Sadie. I'm oh. telling you. I heard that. You know what? I don't really appreciate with this game. It when it takes over and chooses which weapons to give me. I think I clearly stated I want my semi-automatic shotgun. The game was like, nope, you're going to get the bolt action rifle or whatever the fuck it was called. Luminary, you need to fuck off. It's going to head off before the law arrives. Where are you going now, Luminary? You were in my butt just a second ago. Okay. Okay. Um... What? Excuse me? Who is this? Edith Downs. Well then. We know what we're doing. That's just gonna have to chill. And another one. What? Damn, what's going on here? There's a lot of motherfuckers. It's three strangers. Yep. You wouldn't happen to be on the train tracks, would you? Wait. Oh. Let's not fall down, Luminary, please. You say help, but... Yo? You okay? Help! You, you help. sick, partner? Uh, it, it's in Whoa. me. They're in me. Yeah, you're not well, friend. Uh, Butch's crick. Butch's crick. Uh, where? Uh, Butch's crick. Is that where you're from? Which is great. You want me to take you back or uh, me? Uh, come on, let me get you home. Things have not turned out well for Super Mario these days, man. Oh, butchers, great. It feels more like he was running away from that place. Excuse you? Oh, 
Okay, oh. be careful not to drown the stranger. Wreck into deep water. Okay. Gotcha, game. Yes, yes, you. Oh, I don't even have to have my... Good. Let's see what we got. Okay. Lemuel, I fucking clearly said I want to remove you from Luminary. Yeah, uh, he was in some distress. <laughs> yeah, he uh, seems calmer now. I found him out in the woods. Well, Lemuel, sweet Lemuel, such a nurse man, such a good man. Come here, Lemuel. come on. Get up here, I'll help you. Up. Since the troubles began, he just he's not the same. It's in me. Why is he looking at me funny? Uh, no, he, he's not well. It's, it's, it's the darkness. It, he said it's the darkness. Who says it's the darkness? Well, the villagers. So thank you, sir. I thank, thank you for lim <laughs> What the fuck, Lemuel? Please, please, sir. Ah. Uh, uh, them you are not well, sir. Uh, uh, you got yeah. anything for me? Oh, yeah. Of course, sir. Love and friendship in the darkness. What else are there? Obadiah Hinton, that's me. Yeah. <laughs> love and friendship. Friendship and love. We're not a rich mm -hmm. village, sir. But with love, rich. We thank uh, you. Okay. So... Was that it? Interesting. Seems to me like we have another one. Is that Edith? I thought I saw HL. MD? Who the hell? Marco Dragic. Oh! Shit! I'll be damned. And then there is him. Henry Lemire. What the fuck? There's a lot. There is a lot. Okay. So. Shit. You're asking for a little bit too much from me here, buddy. You know what? That's it. We're gonna call it an episode. Next episode is going to be either Stranger Things Part 3 or Part 4. <laughs> Until then, it's been your boy Kago Gaming. I'm out of here. Love y'all and deuces.